I got too many t-shirts. Look at this. So first, let me explain something to you. I have a theory about t-shirts and everyone needs t-shirts. Whether you wear them under something or you wear, you wear them just for fun, but t-shirts are the only thing ever to wear. What happened was, at one point in time, I decided to start a t-shirt company and, well, I started buying a lot of t-shirts. And I printed a lot of weird things on t-shirts. So, well, let, let me show you just one of the weird things I printed that I kept and I probably don't need to keep. I made that t-shirt and I probably don't need that t-shirt. But I've kept that t-shirt because, well, I don't like to get rid of anything. I'm not a hoarder, but I hoard t-shirts. I'm officially a t-shirt hoarder, but um, we gotta get rid of some t-shirts. So I think we've gotta get rid, I, I think we gotta go through these. We gotta go through these t-shirts to see what, what we can get rid of and what we can't. So it's a big deal. Gotta get rid of t-shirts. I need a goal, and that goal has got to be to get rid of a t-shirt or two, or nothing should be sitting on the ground. I shouldn't have t-shirts out anymore, and those boxes, they don't count either because they're all blank, so you can go to a storage in them, but I should get rid of them too, and we got to have something to like sell, and then there's goodwill and stuff, like giveaways, and... I have a few and I wear most of them, but we do have to get rid of some. So I think we're gonna start to categorize these. And the way we categorize these are, first of all, we can never get rid of any vintage band shirts. No, none of that. Metallica, Foo Fighters, Guns N' Roses, especially Guns N' Roses. I have a collection of Guns N' Roses. There will be no getting rid of Guns N' Roses shirts. There will also be no getting rid of like the ones I, 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 I like, okay? So we'll categorize those. Then it'll be all the other stuff, like the workout shirts. I don't think I need any workout shirts. That's a myth. There's no such thing as a workout shirt. So let's get to moving these around, shall we? Yeah, let, let's, let's move them.
consider this a success. These are the shirts I'm keeping. We got sports shirts, concert shirts, plane shirts, character shirts, Guns N' Roses shirts, Metallica shirts, normal everyday shirts, surf shirts, and long sleeve shirts. And then, who doesn't need like a G.I. Joe shirt, you know, in like their 40s? I don't. I don't need a G.I. Joe shirt. I love that shirt, but it comes with great embarrassment, whoever I'm around that I'm wearing it, so we're not wearing that anymore. And then, here it is. The pile of shirts I'm actually getting rid of. I got rid of some t-shirts. I don't like getting rid of t-shirts, but I had too many t-shirts. That's all right. Got less t-shirts now. If you want some t-shirts, let me know. I got plenty. And let's do it again tomorrow. All right? And remember, click the subscribe, ring the bell, or, or not, doesn't matter. Just come back tomorrow and watch some of these other videos. All right? Bye.